Sausage burritos, just the burritos, with some mild salsa. Is that all for you today? That'll be it. Okay, that'll be six for you at the first window. Thank you. Thank you. So we have McDonald's. I got a drink there because the, I don't like the soda at Burger King. Well, and Burger King has the multi drink thing. Where are you going? You're driving right by the oh, Burger King. It's true. They move the entrance. Really? Okay, we're gonna go. We're gonna go this way. <laughs> oh. How many times have we gone to the Burger King? I want to go this way. Well, you're getting a little tour of the main street in well, Pittsburgh. Well, I really wanted to show our viewers Dylan's. <laughs> Dylan's? You mean Kroger? No, Dylan's. This is the right one. It says Dylan's, Dylan. but it's really Kroger. It's Dylan's. It's Kroger. Kroger just looks like Dylan's. No. Anywho, back to Burger King. You we finally made it to Burger King. Good afternoon, welcome to Burger King. My name is Carly. What can I get started for you today? I would like two croissants, uh, sausage and cheese. Ham and cheese. No Ham egg. and cheese. Oh, sorry. Ham and cheese. No <laughs> egg. Does he not know me at all? Yes. Okay. Yeah. Two croissants, ham and cheese, no egg. That should be it. Okay. Can I just do the Hershey's pie today? No, thanks. Alright, that'll bring us all to the 436 with the second window. Burger King! But yet, he has McDonald's. Mm -mm -mm. Such a waste. Missouri. It's a really nice day to be out. Joplin. We're probably not staying here very long, but we're going to cut through and see if there's anything to see. We left Joplin, got on the interstate for a little while, for like, what, 10 minutes or something like that, 10 or 15. Uh, just, I don't even know what exit we turned Straight. off at. 
which is turned off at County Road 100. Well, we were just, no. <laughs> we were just driving. It's like, well, I'm going to pull off, and turn off at the next exit. So we weren't really paying attention to which one it was going to be. So we just picked the exit, turned off, and now we're on the back roads. We're going to see if we can find something cool or be where we don't find anything. I don't know. We're going this way. Turn a couple of times at random. The road is getting a little more narrow and a little less smooth. Still paved though. There's a lot of not much of anything out here, but nice area. Gorgeous country. Pretty neat homes. Pretty cool street names. Yeah, the roads are cool. We're on tiger. We're on tiger now. So we passed reindeer. Getting into hill country. This is why we come to the Ozarks. you're going to find on these back roads. That was a deal. Dead one. Was it? Mm -hmm. Like it was still looking good. There were bugs. Yeah. Looked like Ew. it might have been a little flat. Not like totally flat. Though. Like usually if they get ran over, they're going you know, smushed. <laughs> like most things when they get run over. Yeah, but that one didn't look smushed. It just looked a little flat. <laughs> Starting to air back up. Somewhere. We found a town. There's a church. Uh, yes. Yeah. Richie, Richie Baptist Church. A building? That's that neat. doesn't look like anybody's in anymore. Maybe better look. That is cool. Open door policy. And oh, another little, little building over there. And what is this? What we got over here? Mm. Oh, a boat. Good looking Jeep. And a motorcycle. A train going Boat's back there? Plane. What is the name of that this town? Probably Richie. Richie? That's what the church was. Richie Rich? This is a road or a driveway? It looks like it has a street sign, Jefferson right. Street. I feel like we're driving into a field. Ooh, that road looks good. We'll just keep following. Keep going straight. Get back the way we came. I think that's a driveway. Is it? I don't know. It's a stop sign. Uh, it could be a lane. Let's find out. I think it's a mixture. I think it's like a multi drive. Driveway. Yeah, like not one driveway, but it's like multiple houses. But mm -hmm. that's not actually going on. It doesn't say no outlet, but. We're going to go this way. Yeah, let's go this way. Another little church. Population 158. Founded in 1844. According to the science. According to the science. It's a pretty tree. I like that tree. See that tree? That's pretty. Yeah. Whoop, 
circling back. Yeah, we're cruising down the road and saw something. I don't know. I saw something and pointed she, it Well, out. we both, she saw, saw it, it first. first. She mentioned it first. We saw it. I may not, I might not actually go to the place, but I need to circle back and get a better look. It's sort of like, oh, at a livable like house. Bowling. I'm sorry. I, I don't think anybody lives there. Look at this reflection. It's just my belly. That's not good. I didn't see any of the trucks it's <laughs> just like so. Ooh, that looks good. Yeah, that, that would be fun. Right, let's, try. let's try it again. We are somewhere in Missouri. Past the Osho, but not quite down to 76 Highway yet. All trucks. That one looks like a drive. Huh. <laughs> Ooh, check. Huh. Interesting. We really don't know where we're at at this point but I saw something else so we're going to turn around and go back again and I know what the answer is going to be but I'd like to get a better look at stuff so Ooh. this place is not what I was looking for but they have a Volkswagen I like this wheels slots on it I knocked there's a dog inside. No one came. But as of yet, nobody's at the door. So, I guess we'll go on. Like, NG would be fun to ask about. But I was just looking for a picture of the pump. But, I'm not going to do that if nobody comes to the door. Because that's trespassing and that's wrong. Uh -huh. That anyone who trespasses on other people's property don't do it. Get permission. Go home. So. Come back later. We are just outside of Cassville, Missouri. There's a little restaurant, diner, something or the other that looks good. Uh, at least from what she sees on her phone. So we're gonna go check it out, maybe grab some lunch, and maybe some pie. We are at the Farmer's Daughter, Ozark Eatery. Yeah, it smells real good. These are like homemade potato chips with queso and chorizo. Really, really good. Four ounce sirloin on mac and cheese, and a build your own burger with mashed potatoes and gravy. Looks really good. We are full, we have leftovers, and we are leaving. Check this out.
Pretty slick old five window advanced design Chevrolet. This is Fierce City. City. Is it open or not? It looks open, it, yeah. It has an open sign on it. Stop there real quick and then head back. It's fine. We're gonna go look at stuff! They have an ice cream parlor too. Mm. Getting a little roaming in. And we saw this, which is really town cool. Hall. Yeah, the town hall. So basically, you're looking at an old fire station with the bell and the large door there. That is so cool. And it's really close to this little church. What used to be a little church. Hmm. Mm. It's not black. It doesn't have to be black. I love black. I love the bandage hands in, but there's so many of them out there. Like the General Lee. It's really cool to see a charger that's not a General Lee. As much as I love the General Lee, having all of them be the same is not necessary. It really is, you know? And it's sad because, like, the little kid in me wants a Bandit Chains Am or a General Lee, or even the, uh, not as common, but the, like the Starsky and Hutch Torino. But it's just tough when they're like celebrity cars, so they're overly done. If anybody listening has any of those, like I will make exceptions. Like I would still love to own them. So if you have any that you feel like you need to rehome, uh, the toy box is open for donations. Not that I expect that to happen. Okay, let's go look at stuff. Broken store. Eh, it's kind of old, but it doesn't look like it's really broken. Let's do it. Is it? Still on the road, but we're getting close. We're probably half an hour or so from home. They're sure getting these windmills put up. They're... They are kind of neat to watch, but they were more fun when they were out west. You could watch them going to Colorado. Uh, I'm less of a fan now that they're, you know, everywhere. So... They're huge. There's a lot of negatives. I mean, there's, you know... That, you know, natural harness the wind power, which is good, but there's a lot of negatives to them. They really pollute the, the, the skyline, the Kansas skyline, you know. Um, you know, they're big, they're expensive, they take up a lot of space, uh, they take away quite a bit of farmland. I know people plant around them, but I don't know, I'm not sold on them. But, regardless, we are heading back, and we're going to get some vehicles moved and some stuff done, and still be productive, even though we've been out road tripping so far today. <laughs>